family gatherings, office parties, and shopping lines. They are already happening, and doctors now worried about the possible strain on hospitals. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Christine Galvan. And I'm Oscar Adami. Experts say there is one more than one variant circulating, so what are the things to consider? Here's Channel 5 Santiago Caicedo. The pandemic has changed many holiday traditions for Darcy Ramirez. Hispanic families get together for gatherings, uh, meals and stuff like that, and we don't get as, as we used to. Omicron has surprised a lot of us about how infectious it is. Doctors are warning even if someone is completely vaccinated against COVID-19, the Omicron variant could be passed down to a much more vulnerable person, and there's a high chance they'll land in the hospital. We are seeing an increasing number of cases at this moment. We are seeing an increasing number of, of hospitalization. Some experts also warn about the current triple threat from the flu and the Delta and Omicron variants all at the same time. It's projected the number of hospitalizations in Texas during January will go up, straining hospitals once again. Anytime we get into a surge, um, we unfortunately see our mortality increase in COVID and non-COVID patients. Before hitting the road this holiday season, some experts are recommending some things that might sound familiar to you from last year. They're saying to celebrate Christmas with your closest family, and if you're going to be with other people you don't live with, celebrate outdoors and get a COVID test before doing so. In McAllen, Santiago Caicedo, Channel 5 News.